Hi, it's Oliver and Daniel, and welcome to our monthly wrap. In an attempt to fire up the economy, the RBA has delivered yet another interest rate cut, the third in five months. The previous cuts have not had the desired effect, but have reinvigorated the property market, which continues its surge. Clearance rates have anchored in the 70s, and some prices being achieved are at their highest point since 2017. Let's hope that the rate cut this time has the desired effect. News that the vacant site next to the 7-Eleven on the corner of Beecroft and Carlingford Roads is earmarked for 442 apartments has drawn the ire of locals, with many pointing out that it's actually commercial developments, not residential ones, that Epping needs. Epping is a great location, but lacking in commercial properties and the quality tenants that they attract. And we certainly don't need more apartments. Down the road at Macquarie Park, the $1.8 billion Ivanhoe Estate redevelopment on the corner of Herring and Epping Road has undergone revisions to its master plan, with an increase to open spaces, reduction in building setbacks, and lowering of building heights as the original plan came under attack being described as an ecological disaster. The common thread with these developments is that both projects are on state government land and unfortunately outside of the control of their local councils. Speaking of which, a development application has been lodged with Ride Council for the construction of a boarding house in a quiet cul-de-sac in Marsfield. The proposed development contains 12 boarding rooms under the provision of the State Environmental Planning Policy affordable rental housing in 2009. Having been through a similar battle recently alongside the residents of the Dunbar Park Estate, which thankfully the community won, it's important locals have their say when plans such as these are made available to the public, as it's the only way to see them defeated. With only 12 weeks left of the selling season, the opportunity to sell in 2019 is drawing to a close. If you'd like to take advantage of low interest rates, high demand and low supply, please get in touch with us today and we'd love to help you out. See you next month.